Hey everybody, check it out. Here we have the Bell Howl Monster Zapper. It's not that big. I don't know why they call it the monster. Um, I don't know, the reviews were good, as seen on TV for whatever reason. This is an indoor one. I believe it says somewhere. But it's supposed to be for a large area. I'm gonna run it in my shop. And yeah, here it says indoor with a chain for hanging. Um, I think this will be perfect to hang in my shop. Um, I'll have a link down below in the description. You can check it out. They have it on Amazon, which has lots of good reviews. I ended up getting it at my local Ace Hardware. They had to order it in and um, it was cheaper than it was on Amazon. So I figured what the heck. But with the good reviews online, at least I could research it and kind of know what I had coming, you know? So get in the box here for you. some manuals or instructions or something so that's all you get in the box here's your instructions whoops <clears throat> blah 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 how it works some info how the, where the switch is how it works how to hang it and how to clean it there's a tray underneath it looks like turn it off before you do that clearly okay good good Take the plastic off here and see what it actually looks like. I have not seen one in person. So here's the chain and hooks. What's this other paper here? Arbitration agreement. Hold on, let me uh, get this chain out and I'll show you how long that is. Okay, here's the chain. Not super long. Just enough to kind of, I mean, you're going to use it kind of in a V shape, right? Something like that, hooking to the top of this thing. got these little little pads that pull up here to hook the chain onto One on each side on the top I guess that's the back this would be the front so here's your little tray that you'll pull out and clean I don't know if I hang it in my shop I might not even put that on there just let stuff kind of fall and you've got your power cord and your plug-in and then you're off on switch so let me plug it in and see what happens See what it looks like. Okay, I've got it plugged in, hooked up. Uh, I'm gonna kinda hang it here because it was convenient. These little hooky things, once I squeezed them to put them on, they kinda stayed compressed. It's kinda, I'm not gonna lie, it's kinda cheesy how it hooks onto the plastic. If it doesn't hold up, I may end up hooking it to the metal. But anyway, here we'll turn it on for the first time. Got a nice little glow to it. I guess we'll give it a little time and see if it zaps. I'm assuming the light attracts them and then they go into this grid thing here. This grid that's a little different color, um, which hooks to whatever these things. I bet that gives them the juice. So I only see that on one side. So anyways, we'll see. We'll leave it plugged on here for a while and we'll see if we can catch something and we'll come back, I'll let you know. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I looked in the tray and there was a couple bugs in it. And one was a fly that was still alive, so I took it and I threw it into there and it snapped and it flew away. So I'm kind of questioning the power of this thing. So I'm gonna let it run overnight, leave it on in the shop here because I have a lot of problems with bugs. You can see my fly strips are just full of bugs, but uh, we'll see how many are in there in the morning. i see if I can blow them in there. What? Oh, it's not totally dead. Where'd he go? There he is. He must be stunned. Let's see if I can get him in there. Nope. Darn it. It's been a couple days. You can see here in the tray, we've got a few dead flies, so it's doing something. I have chucked a really big fly in there and it zapped, but it didn't kill it. And a couple times I pulled the tray out and there was a big fly in it. I don't know if it got stunned or maybe it flew in there just to hang out. I'm not sure. I can see right down here there's a little, a couple little guys stuck in between there. But it's it's buzzed a few. I see some dead ones in there. So, anyways, it's working. Please follow my link down in the description to check it out. And I hope this was useful to you. Like, comment, and subscribe. John BH out. 
Okay, one more update. It's been probably about a week. You can see we got a few things kind of stuck in there, but you can see the tray focus. It's doing pretty good. We're catching a lot of bugs in the tray. So that's good. I haven't had really much of a fly problem lately because they're kind of coming into fall season, winter season, but not winter, but fall. But <clears throat> anyways, we're a little low on the bugs in the shop right now. So all in all, I think it's going to work good. So like, comment, and subscribe.